My name is Hannah Weingartner and I'm from Lima, Ohio. My family and I raise, sell, and promote beef cattle. And today we are going to inform you on the beef industry. Did you know that the United States of America is one of the top beef producing countries in the world? It all starts in ranches where calves are born, raised, vaccinated, and taken care of by ranchers before heading to a feedlot. Here is John Razor from Georgia to tell you about a feedlot. A feedlot is an animal feeding operation which is used for feeding livestock prior to being harvested. Feedlot workers work hard every day to ensure a healthy and nutritious product for consumers. Thank you for watching our video and I hope you have a better understanding of the beef industry. This has been Hannah Weingartner and John Reeser and I hope you have an outstanding day. Here I have Ben Williams, the livestock judging coach at North Dakota State University. And Ben, I'd like to ask you a few questions. How does your job here at North Dakota State help the general public understand the livestock industry? Well, my job kind of includes a multitude of facets involved in the livestock industry. It doesn't just deal with beef specifically, but I also have the opportunity to work with uh, sheep, swine, uh, and cattle, uh, really in the classroom setting. And I have a great opportunity from being the livestock judging team coach to take kids out into the industry, uh, to promote the industry, and to allow those students to see really what the industry is all about. We spend a lot of time on the road. We spend a lot of time at different ranches, different producers, and really my job is to prepare those kids to go out uh, into the world after they get out of college and really help to educate the public on their experiences, what they saw when they grew up. So they're really becoming advocates for our industry. So my role really within the university is to not only uh, just educate uh, in the classroom, but a lot of it is outside the classroom. A lot of uh, practical production practices we try to teach these kids uh, to go on and share the story of agriculture. Yes, thank you very much.